Hi guys and welcome to TechBased. In this video, I'm going to show you how to manually enable the new tabs in the File Explorer, also with the new navigation pane that we can find as well in the File Explorer in Windows 11, the version 25136. I've made a video a few hours ago in which I talked about the new Windows 11 version for the dev channel. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to manually enable those features because those features are only available or only enabled for a certain number of Windows insiders. So you can test those features out if you want, but you need to enable those features manually. Before doing anything, please don't forget to leave a like down below and also subscribe to the TechBase channel if you enjoy videos like these where I show you how to enable certain hidden features or limited features in Windows 11. Before continuing with the video, I just want to answer a quick question that I've gotten on a couple of videos and that is if the tabs for File Explorer will be available in Windows 11 version 22H2. Well, that isn't the case. Windows 11 version 22H2 reached its final development state and as we have it now, now, that's how we will receive it on the main release. But tabs and also other features will be available in a later update or version of Windows 11 maybe next year. So let's start with the video. Of course, we need to download Vive Tool. We've talked about Vive Tool in a certain amount of videos and maybe some of you know how to use Vive Tool. Well, you just need to go in the article down below in the description and click on the link to download Vive Tool and download the latest version .zip. You just need to click on it to download it, go into the location where you downloaded it, right click on it, then show more options and extract all if you want to extract using the official extracting tool from Windows 11. Basically, you'll need to extract this archive into the system 32 location. I'm just going to click on browse this PC and then local disk C, then Windows and then scroll down to system 32 selected, click on select folder, extract, click on replace the files in the destination, continue and again continue and you should be good to go. I had to replace the files because I already had Vive tool extracted there. For those of you who don't know, Vivetool is a small little app that can help you enable certain hidden features or testing features in Windows 11. What you need to do next, just open up CMD. So we're going to open up the search box, type in here CMD, right click on CMD, and then click on run as administrator. On user account control, click on yes. In CMD, you're going to have to paste in two commands, two different commands. One will be for the tabs and one will be for the new navigation pane. As easy as that. First command will be this one, Vive tool add config 376343852. Basically, two says that this feature or config will be enabled press enter and you should receive the message successfully set feature configuration and also the second command will be this one vive tool add config 36354489 as enabled and you should also receive successfully set feature configuration message. You will be able to find these commands in the article down below in the description. You can now exit out from the CMD. After that, you're going to need to restart the computer for the changes to take effect. Now, after the restart, if you open up Windows Explorer or File Explorer, you'll be able to see the new tabs in the File Explorer and also the new navigation pane, which is a little bit bugged in my opinion right now. But of course, it's still in the early stage. It actually looks really good in my opinion. And also, the new tabs in the file explorer look pretty good. They are a little bit laggy if you ask me when you open them up. And what is nice about them, if you right click on a certain tab, you have some options, close tab, close other tabs or close tabs to the right. That's actually really useful. I'm sure that Microsoft will introduce a lot more options related to tabs in the File Explorer. And as we've talked about in the previous video that I've made presentation of this build, the new navigation pane tries to bring better productivity to Windows 11 users and may basically categorize certain things better. I think that's pretty good. And it also looks really good because we finally have a change in the navigation pane. But of course, the highlight of the build are the new tabs in the File Explorer. As I've said, they are a little bit slow right now, even when you create a new tab, but I'm sure that Microsoft will work on this more. As you can see, it has small letter box. For example, if I right click on a tab and then I <laughs> click on a empty area, this menu won't disappear, but you just have to click on the tab again. But that's not a problem. That's really good that Microsoft is working on this. And I'm sure that they will improve it better and better until its final release. So basically, this is how you can enable the new tabs in the File Explorer with the new navigation pane in Windows 11 25136. If you've enjoyed this video, please don't forget to check out the article down below in the description for the commands and also for the Vive tool download link. Also, don't forget to leave a like down below and subscribe to the TechBase channel with the notification bell activated so that you won't miss any future uploads like this one. I was Emmanuel from TechBase. Until next time, have a nice day.